morning guys welcome to today's vlog Carson is at the movies right now so I'm home with Bennett um, he's actually down for his first nap of the day and he's in his crib if y'all follow me on Instagram and y'all see my stories that I post y'all would know that I posted this morning that we're starting the crib train today I'm a nervous wreck he slept in his crib before a couple times and he usually does fine but he just doesn't sleep as good as he does like in his mama room. I've been putting off crib training for a really long time just because I don't want to do it. And I know that's bad. He's five months old and so I'm starting it now. So if y'all have any tips that really helped y'all like crib training y'all's little ones, let me know in the comments below because I really need all the advice I can get. He's growing up too fast y'all. Like time just is going way too fast and I'm not okay with it. I have his monitor set up in here in my room so I can see him. Right now he has one camera <laughs> that's set up, the other one's still in the box. So I'm just going in there periodically and checking on him and looking at the camera that I do have set up and it's not bad. All right, so as y'all can see, the camera's not really set up super well. Like I said, it's kind of on the ledge of the crib but I can still see his face and I'm still going in there every once in a while and checking on him to make sure he's okay. And yeah, this is just what we're working with for now. He's sound asleep. So far, so good. He's been in there for about 20 minutes now. So hopefully he takes a nice long nap and we have a good rest of the day. Okay, so just a little update on how the whole <laughs> crib training is going. Um, literally like 10 minutes after my last clip when I showed y'all um, Bennett in his crib, he wakes up. Hey, mister. Hey. Did you have a good nap? You just wanted to take a little cat nap today? You're crazy. Did you sleep good in your crib? I lose my breath whenever I see you. You stole my heart. What is it that you do? So I wanted to show y'all what his closet looks like now after I went through all of his newborn clothes and zero to three month size clothes. Um, it's looking very empty now. So everything from here to about here is what fits him now. Um, all of that is clothes that are too big for him right now. As you can tell, we have a lot of size three to six and a few six to nine, but other than that, we're gonna have to start shopping for him soon and getting bigger clothes. All of these clothes right here is what I'm saving for future babies that I like, or outfits that I just love that Bennett never wore a lot. We now have a million hangers that we used to not have. There's a lot more space. It was definitely bittersweet going through all of those clothes. It was kind of sad putting all the clothes away and I'm actually giving some of the clothes that Bennett barely wore to my cousin. They're expecting their first little boy in November. So I'm going to give them their, those clothes, see if they want any of them. What are you saying over here? 
I set you down just for a second so I can go put all of your clothes up. And you're in here talking? Yeah. You love your crib, huh? Hey. <laughs> Say hi. Oh goodness, you are just too cute. I can't handle it. I wanted to show y'all our little setup in here. We have this little set of like foam squares that we put on the floor since we have hardwood floors. Oh my God, look at him, he's about to roll over. Am I getting this on camera right now? Do it, baby! Oh my God, are you gonna roll over? Okay, <laughs> never mind. But yeah, this is the setup in the living room. We have a few other little chairs that we put out here sometimes. But since we have wood floors, we put the foam squares down. Oh my God, he's doing it again again. Come on, baby. Come on. You can do it. Oh, man. You're so close. You're so close. I'm going to set the camera up. And we're going to montage this until he does it. Set my world on fire You're my heart's desire I just want to love you Just want to hold you Just want to be with you Till we grow old Please tell me you'll stay Or take me away I want you for myself Every single day Somebody still looks sleepy. <laughs> yep. Hey. Were you watching mommy do her hair? Were you? You were being such a good boy while I did my hair. Yeah. You're being such a good boy. Do you want the book? So when I'm at home alone with Bennett, either when Carson's at work or if he's out running errands and I'm at home and I want to do my hair or I want to get something done, that's the chair I always put him in. That's usually what I do. I'll set him in here with me or I'll even bring his little play mat in here and set it on the floor in my room and he'll just sit with me while I do my hair or while I'm doing my makeup, which I hardly ever wear makeup, but if it's a rare occasion that I'm wearing makeup and I have to do it and I'm alone with him and I need help with him. I'll just occupy him for like 20, 15, 20 minutes while I get whatever I need to get done. And he's usually pretty good about it. He literally just sat here this whole time and watched me straighten my hair. So now I'm going to feed him and he'll probably end up going back to sleep. He keeps rubbing his eyes and his eyes are super red. So I don't know how well this next nap's going to go. <laughs> I'm trying not to give in and put him in his mama room even though I really want to. It's hard, y'all. It's hard. So as you can see, I gave in and he's napping in his mama room. But you know what? I don't really care. <laughs> he napped in his crib once today. He can nap in it later. At least I didn't once. So progress is progress, right? Did you say hi, Michael?
Hey, hey, he's got the couple new hats. <laughs> I just want to give you a little recap of last time when I went to Medieval Times. I had a great time. It was my first time. Food was great. It was awesome. Bro wasn't there, but that guy that you see in the video a lot is Michael. He's one of my best friends. He's with the Air Force. But yeah, I just want to give you a recap since I really didn't explain anything in the video or anything about yesterday at Medieval Times. So just a little short briefing. Have you never been or you, the whole stage act and everything was awesome too, you know? I got really into it, but I was drinking a little bit too, so I really got into it. <laughs> I had, my, I had a, like a big mug filled of, of contents that you are only supposed to have when you're 21 or older. I was freaking throwing it up in there like, huzzah, you know? I'm cheering, woo! Yeah, it was it was fun. Carson signing off. Hi guys, so we're back home now, and we're getting ready to get Bennett ready for bed and stuff. But we wanted to answer the questions that y'all asked us on Instagram. So the first question is, how did you get the courage to start a YouTube channel? Honestly, Carson told me like I just needed to do it because I've been talking about it for such a long time. And he was like, you just need to do it. Yeah, so I just kind of, just one day I was just like, no, I'm just going to do it. I don't care what anyone thinks of me, like, for doing it. I'm just going to do it because I want to do it. That's why I tell her. So, yeah, pretty much that's how I got the courage to do it. Um, someone asked, when's baby number two coming? Shit, nine months from now. <laughs> I'm not pregnant right now. Not yet. There's no plans for baby number two, y'all. I don't know when baby number two is coming, but... After she graduates college and stuff and gets a job. And that, that's what we talked about, Dan. But if it comes sooner, it, co it comes sooner. I don't, I don't care. I'm just going with the flow. <laughs> we want at least three or four kids, right? Mm -hmm. Three at least, maybe four. So, I don't know. Part of me really wants Bennett to have a sibling like a year and a half to two years apart. But I know that I should probably wait a longer. But it's hard because I want him to have a sibling close in age. So I don't know. I don't know what we're gonna do yet. Y'all will just find out. <laughs> What's been the hardest challenge becoming a new mom? The hardest part for me probably is just him needing me all the time and me not being able to do what I need or want to do. Like some days I can't, like when Carson's gone, some days I can't do my hair. Some days I can't go work out because we work out outside and it's too hot to bring Bennett outside, especially in the Texas heat. So, that's probably the hardest thing for me. Um, who wears the pants in the relationship? Me. I don't know. I feel like we both... I have one leg in and he has the other leg yeah. in. So it's kind of like half and half. Okay, who's the most sensitive? Like, we're both sensitive, but maybe I'm a little more sensitive than he is. I don't know. About what? Like, no, tell me what you think I'm more sensitive about and I'll try to tell you. You're just more sensitive and more, like, in a relationship. I mean, yeah, I, 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 I can actually see that actually now you're saying that because... I'm always checking and making sure you're all like, are you alright? Are you alright? I, mean, I can be sensitive, but other like most of the time I'm just like, I'm just not. That's all the questions that we got asked and that we're going to be answering today. If y'all have any more, leave them in the comments and we'll answer them for y'all. Make sure you give us a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Alright, well Carson basically said it, so. Make sure you keep an eye out for our next video on on Twitter and Instagram. Um, I'll pop all of our links up on the screen somewhere. My Instagram and Twitter and Carson's Instagram and Twitter. Do so you make sure. That? Yeah. I never see it. So make sure y'all um, go follow us on those platforms and y'all see us more. I post daily on Instagram, on my stories and everything, so y'all can keep up with me more on Instagram. Just make sure y'all go follow us on there and don't forget to subscribe. And we will see y'all in our next video. Right. Bye. Bye. Pop that out. <laughs>